Hello, my friends of the galaxy. Today I will talk to you about transitions. It means change. Changes. I hear a bicycle ringing and this is Lily. Hello, Lily. She is going to transition from the park to her neighborhood. Did you hear her bicycle ring? Ding, 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 ding. She is going to also learn about how we use transitional words or phrases to signal changes, to vary sentences, and to connect ideas in sentences paragraphs. Here she has transitioned into a park again, and she is going to give some examples of transitional words or phrases. These are three examples of transitional words or phrases. Sometimes traditional words show steps or sequence. Sometimes they show how an idea is different from another idea and connect two sentences. And some transitional words explain or give conclusions. Remember that they are almost always used at the beginning of the sentence and they are followed by a comma. They can be one word or two. So these are some transitional words or phrases. Let's apply this knowledge in a passage. Bye-bye, Lily. How cool is that we have a passage about the history of the bicycle when Lily is on a bicycle. Oh, hi, Lily. Welcome back. So let's look for some transitional words. There are three in this passage. This passage shows a timeline, the history of the bicycle. So these transitional words show when different things happened. So these transitional words show time. They signal change of time. Next time you read a passage or next time you write something to show how ideas are connected, Use transitional words or phrases. More later. Ding, ding. Bye-bye.